All right, so far we've gone on a dolphin tour, got my pirate acting skills on the Black Dragon, and also checked out that local fishing scene as well. So now it's time to kick it up a notch. And I mean way, way up, you know what I mean? We're going parasailing, y'all. Okay, so this is gonna be my first time going parasailing. Uh, what do I need to know? Do, do I need experience? Uh, can you kind of give me the rundown? I'm kind of freaking out a little for, bit. For parasailing, you really don't need much experience. Um, as Hank explained, you, you, we put you in a harness, pretty much like a swing, and you just sit down and have a good time. All righty, we're ready to go. I'm used to solid ground. You know, it's kind of like reverse skydiving. Instead of parachuting down from a plane, you're parachuting up from a boat. Mind blown. And after the parachute was ready and flying, it was my turn to launch. <laughs> Is this really my job right now? So crazy, yet so peaceful and relaxing at the same time. Definitely YOLO Texas approved. have to come check it out. Beautiful, beautiful! So after that, it was back into town to check out the dining scene. South Padre is famous for its spring break nightlife, but in fact, there's plenty of places for families and foodies alike too. And so, I headed to the Painted Marlin Grill to chow down. Recently opened, the Painted Marlin is just one of the great dinner spots on South Padre with al fresco dining, great views on the bayside, and a cocktail menu to match the island mood. And the best part about the Painted Marlin? Well, remember the fish I caught yesterday? The Painted Marlin will cook it right up for you. Talk about fresh. You got it grilled, you got it fried, you get a little bit of it all. Okay, so this is a Captain Marlin. It's one half hurricane, one half margarita. And by the looks of it, it looks more like one whole margarita, one whole hurricane. I'm gonna try it out. Here's the vacation. Oh yeah. With the full stomach and after finishing that Captain Marlin drink, I was ready for a little relaxation on the beach. All right, I got my SPF, my H2O, and my book. So if you need me, I'll be here for a bit. See ya. With my vacation time quickly coming to an end, I decided to hit up one more location for one last bit of adrenaline. As you can see, you got mini golf, you got lots of rides for the kids, and if you're up for it, maybe we can go for a swing on the Sky Coaster. What do you say? And after that first shot of adrenaline, I was ready for more. <laughs> yeah, and as fun as that sounds, what really caught my eye was the epic looking go-kart track in the back. So what do you say? We go ahead and check it out. Being a pretty competitive person, I challenged our producer to a friendly race. Three, two, one, yellow! But just because the race was over didn't mean the excitement had to stop. And with a name like Gravity Park, you know there's no shortage of ways to get the adrenaline pump in. All in all, not a bad way to finish off our time here on South Padre Island. 
Needless to say, this place is definitely YOLO Texas approved. And I cannot say this strongly enough, if you haven't been to South Padre, you need to check it out. And if you have, well, it's probably time for another visit. Want to plan your trip to South Padre? Go to sopadre.com to learn more or check out the links listed for more information about the activities you saw today.